Yellowstone supervolcano eruption and what would happen. The thought experiment. What would happen if the supervolcano under Yellowstone erupted? Yellowstone National Park is located on top of an active supervolcano that last had a super eruption 640,000 years ago. It had a smaller one 70,000 years ago and it has erupted 80 times since then and they estimate about every 6,000 years. Number one, we would have earthquakes. Months of earthquakes would culminate in a huge quake creating fissures to the magma chamber seven kilometers below. As pressure is released, volcanic gases dissolved in the magma come out of the solution, turning the magma into a boiling froth. Two, there would be a blast wave. The total energy release would be equivalent to an 875,000 megaton explosion. The shock wave would kill 90,000 people. Most of the lava would fall back into the crater and any flows would be slow and only spread 40 to 50 kilometers or so. Number three, ash flows. More dangerous are the pyroclastic flows, the clouds of dense hot ash flowing outwards from the vent. A 2016 study found that the flows would probably move at anywhere between 16 and 72 kilometers per hour. That's slow enough that you could outrun the ash in a car. And number four, volcanic winter. The U.S. would be blanketed with ash up to a meter deep, that's three feet high, in the Salt Lake City area. This would cause respiratory problems. 200 million tons of sulfur dioxide carried into the stratosphere would cool the climate for at least 10 years. This is on Science Focus. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece. In Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.